Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Abraham Adeyemi. It is my privilege to share this word of God with you. I'm going to read from the Bible passage and I wanted to guess where I'm going to read. In the Bible, it says, I'm being found in him, not having my own righteousness, which is of the law, but that which is through the faith of Christ, the righteousness which is of God by faith. Now, Probably you are guessing the person who said that or you are thinking about the person who said that. And the person who made that statement is none other but one of the greatest apostles ever lived through the inspiration of the Holy Ghost. To show what salvation is not all about. Now, if we read prior before that, before he made a statement in the book of Philippians chapter 3, verse 4. He said, though I might also have confidence in the flesh, if any man, if any other man thinketh that he hath whereof he might trust in the flesh, high more. Circumcised the head day of the stock of Israel, of the tribe of Benjamin, and Hebrew of the Hebrews, as touching the law, a Pharisee. Concerning Zeal persecuting the church, touching the righteousness which is in the law blameless so he made so i mean he made it clear about his boast in the flesh and you know sometimes it pains me that when you try to explain the gospel to some people they think uh they have some uh flesh qualification that will get them to heaven it is not possible for you to get to heaven doing the things of the flesh just like Apostle Paul had confidence in the flesh, but his confidence in the flesh can never get him to anywhere until he learned to submit himself to the righteousness of Jesus Christ, which is by faith. So I'm saying this to let you know again, over and over again in my channel, I only talk about Jesus only. Only Christ can save you. Now, if you are trusting other than Christ, if you are trusting anything other than Christ, there is no way you can get to heaven. You have been lied to, you have been deceived. There is no way you can get to heaven. And that is why you need to break out of those religious manipulations, thinking that because you sow seed, because you go to church, because you are doing some religious activities and rituals, then you will get to heaven. You have been lied to. And you can never get to heaven. Now, the Bible says, uh, Philippians chapter 3 verse 9 and be found in him not having my own righteousness which is of the law but that which is through the faith of Christ how can you be found in Christ through the faith of Christ 2 Corinthians chapter 5 verse 21 the Bible says for he hath made him to be sin for us who knew no sin that we might be made the righteousness of God in him so in order for a sinful man can be justified with God there is only one way you can get to heaven, and that is through Christ. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved. Only Christ can save you. All right, if you are not saved, here is another opportunity. If you are trusting in yourself, you have opportunity to accept the free gift of eternal life. It is free. Jesus did it, and it is once and for all. It's not something that you have to redo every time only once and for all jesus made salvation very simple if you reject the work of christ you are bringing damnation to yourselves and there is no way you can make heaven thank you thank you <clears throat> thank you for watching my channel god bless you